Welcome to this episode of Drink Like a Fish. Uh, and tonight we are reviewing um, beer. Beer. Yeah. We'll showing some beer. Showcasing some beer. This is the uh, from Nimbus Brewing Company. down to Nimbus, say hello and buy me a drink, will you? In Arizona, mm -hmm. uh, the uh, Dirty Guerra, I don't... It says right there on the label. Dirty Guerra. I nope, don't... right next to one on the label. Dirty Weta. Dirty Weta. Dirty Weta. It's Dirty Weta Blonde Ale. I don't know if the light can get a little bit of this... Uh, piece of tail on the cover here. It means oh. whale's vagina. Uh. La vagina di una balena. <laughs> oh, salty. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this looks to be like a, a session ale. It's a blonde ale. It's 4% uh, ABV. Mm -hmm. um, I love the, the logo. I mean, any, any beer that's got good artwork, I mean, it's always a winner in my book. It's something that definitely grabs your attention. It's the whole reason I got it when we were going to the, the, the old candy store, as we call it. And um, I actually sent a picture today and was like, dude, we're, we're totally reviewing this. Mm -hmm. as, as soon as we get it, we want to show this on the show. smell the grains. It smells almost like when you take some nice fresh barley. Yeah. And just kind of, you know, get a good whiff of it. It smells like fresh grains. Um, it, it smells good. Um, yeah, very, very uh, sweet. But then you also get sort of those German malts, sort of those um, traditional um, sweet caramel mm -hmm. smellings. Um, and then also at the back end, a floral, uh, almost like a little floral note. A little bit, a little bit. Not really any hop. Um, no. No, no hop scent whatsoever. None of that piney smell or anything. But I mean, I really wouldn't expect that from a blonde ale. Um, but you know, just reporting the facts <laughs> as they are. Just the facts, man. Just the facts, man. Just the facts. <laughs> Sort of that German influence, like a Pilsner. Um, the 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 smell definitely is a, is a good precursor to the taste. But Absolutely. Then on the back end, there's a lot of sort of biscuit. Um, mm -hmm. uh, well, I, I go back to that whole you know that that fresh um, that grain or barley flavor. Mm -hmm. When you take a, a little piece of barley or something, you just kind of chew on it for a little bit. You get that release of sweetness, the sugars. I mean, that's what the yeast feeds on to create the alcohol. But yeah, I think I think a, a good description, which it, it it's, tastes very fresh. It tastes yeah. like somebody brewed it right out there and then brought it to us. Um, it doesn't have any sort of hey, well actually, it doesn't taste uh, like there's any sort of adjuncts or, or like a, one of the macro lagers. It really tastes yeah. super fresh, very sessionable. You could easily fall into a trap of having a bunch of these. Mm -hmm. Every once in a while, we get the question, um, what beers would you suggest to give somebody to, to jump into craft beer? I was just fucking thinking that. This, Swear to God. This is a good gateway beer. Yeah, gateway absolutely. Drug, gateway I was, beer. I was um, just thinking to myself that, uh, you know, especially yeah. with that, that frame set of, oh, you're going to have a couple beers with the guys, you know, most guys who are not craft beer drinkers, mm -hmm. they'll be sitting down drinking like your, your buds or something. And you can, this could be the six pack. You'd be like, hey, man, let's try something different today. You know, you know how I tell you about this craft beers all the time. Well, here's something. It's a little, you know, a little on the mild side. Let's see what you think of it. I, this, this would be a perfect gateway it, beer. This for me, if they if they keep you know selling it out here, I'm gonna keep buying it. This will always have a, a place somewhere in the fridge to be able to bust this out. This is a really good beer. Mm -hmm. Definitely, cool. I'm a fan. Great job, Nimbus. And Nimbus, it's fun to say. Mm -hmm. it sounds like an insult almost. Yeah, great job, Nimbus. <laughs> <laughs> Senorita, subscribe to our channel. <laughs> <laughs>